Hi, my name is Laura Reese, and I'm an intern at the SUNY or West Ferry chapter of NYPIRG, the New Public Interest Research Group. NYPIRG is the largest non-for-profit, non-partisan student advocacy organization. This semester has been very empowering and successful since I, with my fellow interns, did so much to teach the student body about issues concerning them. Things such as higher education, hunger and homelessness, clean air, recycling, and consumer protection, also voter mobilization. As my fall internship came to an end, I wondered, is NYPRA really affecting the student body here at Westbury? So I questioned some people, and here's what they said. NYPRG's unique mission is to give students an array of extracurricular activities and opportunities to participate in important public policy discussions through which they can learn a wide variety of valuable skills contributing to well-rounded educational experience. Students working with professional NYPRG staff help lead a variety of projects and campaigns. This hands-on approach teaches students skills that make them more active members of their community, enhances their academic experience, and prepares them for successful entry into the workforce. Students across the state at NYPIRC's 20 campuses chapters have made tangible contributions on the issues of higher education, funding, consumer rights, environmental protection, mass transit, and homelessness. Since 1973, NYPIRC has provided an unique service of supplementary learning and provided countless students with an enriching and rewarding experience. What is NYPIRC? I don't know. <laughs> okay, what do you think of NYPIRC? I mean, it's cool and all. They, they spread awareness about voting and stuff. <laughs> Anything you have, to, what do you think about Nightbird? Like, um, when do you see people in Nightbird usually? Usually, when I see Nightbird, is either in the beginning of class where they stop the professor and be like, <laughs> "Can I please go see a class about Nightbird and what we do?" That's about it. Thank you. This semester, the SUNY or Westbury chapter of NYPIRC worked very hard for voter mobilization for the students of SUNY or Westbury. We notified the students of their voter rights and got over 400 students registered to vote. Great job. New York, pro, <laughs> proactive. Proactive. New York proactive. Uh huh. Institution. Mm, okay. Uh, that sounds about right. Mm -hmm. Really promotes. Yes, okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Really participates. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Word. Nah, I know that's a good thing. Everybody's in it. Mm -hmm. No. Have you been to any programs? Yes. Exactly. What programs have you been to? Uh, well, um, bunch of them. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> see. I think NYPIRC is a good organization on campus. It helps bring students together, gets to meet one common goal, just to help save the planet and help recycle and reuse and vote. Hello, Zeke. Oh, yes. What do you think about NYPIRC on this campus? I feel <laughs> I feel NYPIRC is uh, very productive. They have um. Um, a lot of educational oh. programs. I don't get to attend a lot of them, but I do attend some. Why you don't get to attend? Uh, because of my busy schedule. You know, I have two jobs, and uh, I have classes. I have to do projects and homework mm. and everything. So I'll check you out. Is Nightperk successful at informing students? Um, yes, I feel they are very successful at informing students. I actually learned how to tie a tie at one of the programs. Is um, it was called um. Business Expo? Mm -hmm, yeah. Yeah, and um, I attended that. I got to learn how to tie a tie and um, interview stuff. What do you think about the 411 interns? Uh, the 411 interns worked very hard. Like, the programs I attended, they was doing their job and everything, going the extra mile. So I think they were very good this year. Do you have any suggestions or questions? Um, 
No, not really. Would you become an intern of Night Park? I've been thinking about it. I'm, I'm going to give a yes or no answer, but it's definitely been a thought. Awesome. Thank you. The Business Expo was an educational program dedicated to help SUNY or Westbury students with career building skills. NYPIRG, along with SWAG, Creation, Delta Sigma Theta Sorority Incorporated, Kappa Alpha Psi Fraternity Incorporated, and Lambda Upsilon Lambda Fraternity Incorporated provided resume building pointers, interviewing do's and don'ts, proper work attire, and various other helpful tips that would help in the business field. Did you go to the Lockett? No, I didn't have a spot. But, um, that's good. I like to study. That's good, yeah. yeah. Nightperk likes the students to study. Mm-hmm. So, I've been trying to, you know, be a good student. That's good. You have any suggestions for Nightperk? Um, just keep doing what you're doing. That's great. Thank you. No problem. Night Nightperk is very successful and informs students because they had this locking program. You had to lock in with all my money. Yes. Hey. <laughs> and like in order to like go to the party, you had to donate a can. And then they had a party, the school party, where you had to um do take a um register to vote. You have to do the voting thing and I'm thinking the school party ticket. So they were getting people aware to like, okay, it's important to vote. The lock in was one of the most successful programs we did this semester. The lock-in was a two-day program in which SUNY or Westbury students locked in to a specific area for a common cause, hunger and homelessness. At this program, we informed students of the harsh realities of poverty in the United States. Here, we collected over $50 and dozens of canned foods for the homeless. I learned from Night Park about the Nassau County bus system that they're gonna shut the bus system down. Like, I take the N20 home to Flushing and it gets me there at 225. So, I'm like, if they do that, then I'm gonna take it a lot double R. Uh, and I'm a college student. Times is hard. Mm -hmm. So, I guess I like Night Park wanting to like have a petition in order to change that. So, I'm all for that. Hello, I was a member of NYPIRG, New York Public Interest Research Group, in fall 2010, and I think it's a great organization for helping students, student activists, and I think that it has improved over the years, it's gotten better when people know about it, <laughs> when people know about it, and it's really helped, it's really been um, growing on our campus, and I think it's a great program and everybody should join. Go NYPIRG! Think about NYPIRG! I think Nightbrook is cool, it's giving an opportunity for students to do well in academics and I think it's, a, it's growth within the community and I'm looking forward to seeing more from you. That's Nightbrook. great. Have you been in, to any programs this semester? I've been to one, um, the fashion show. I think it's kind of dope. Um, mm -hmm. I want to be involved more. Nightbrook, yes. holla at me, man. Love and that. It's a cult, it's like pledging. Why you say that? Because y'all do mad work. <laughs> It'd be ridiculous. I'm doing this for night yeah. prayer. I have to tip for night prayer. I have to, like, no. No, full credit? Yeah. That's too much work. Damn. Maybe, maybe eight. Mm -hmm. Yeah, eight. So that's the suggestion? For eight credits, I would do, so, I would do night prayer. So make that a suggestion next year. For, for eight credits, I will join night prayer. Yes. <laughs> yes. Nah, they be ODing, like they do mad work. Like, no, really? Nightbird has been really helping this campus. She's on the outside. Duh. Duh. Get it? And like handle it. issues. <laughs> That have been affecting the student you. body. Yeah. You don't care. on this campus. <laughs> uh, I think Night Park is a good program. Uh, oh. The interns go hard. Bro, we record them. My bad, yo. <laughs> but the interns go real hard. So I think it's a good organization. It's a good program. It's good. Okay, you can make a little more. Um. That's cool, of course. What programs have you been to? Um, for Nightburg. For Nightburg, I've been to. The locking, mm -hmm. getting crazy in there. Yeah, what you doing the like, the, the locking? Yes. Like, oh, mm -hmm. one time, yes. one time. Mad though. <laughs> um, also, I went to the fashion show. It was really good. A lot of creativity. Um, it really had a different atmosphere. It's great. The day set up, stayed real nice. But, um, the dresses, the everything was amazing. I really enjoyed that. It's something that makes me feel. Most of the events I went to, it was all really good. Enjoy.
Yeah. Um, any suggestions? Or questions? <laughs> Why would I like Night Pearl? I'm oh, Mr. Debonair the first album. Yes. Let me get the vibe. Um, just last week I attended the Night Pearl fashion show and I learned how to be more eco friendly and I thought it was interesting how they made clothes out of the cycle Yeah, what do you think about Nyperg? Um, I think Nyperg is a good organization that keeps, I guess, students involved and I would say it also helps students get more credits, like, to help them get out of college faster. Do you think Nyperg is successful for informing students? Um, yeah, I do think it's successful for informing students. Um, one thing I would say is one, one program I went to was the lock-in. Um, I believe the the cause was to like show everyone that they couldn't like the, the goal was for people to actually stay locked in, and I like a lot of people learned from that. Do you have any suggestions for the upcoming interns? <laughs> what do you think of Nyperg? Well, I think Nyperg is very informative. Um, maybe I'll answer it next time. You <laughs> don't <laughs> fuck no Back to our program. Um, have you been to any programs with Night Park this semester? Um, I have been to two programs by Night Park. One was the lock in. Honestly, I didn't know the purpose of it until somebody um, explained that it was the lock in, how um, homeless people lock themselves in. Um, also, I've been to the fashion shows. I like the fact that they had like bottles as dresses. It was showing environmental, um, environmental, environmental issues. Um, also, the plastic bag as a dress was nice, and they did really well. Shout out to the full eleven interns. Well, I like my home girl Lovey. So when she came out walking in the. And I like the um I like the designs they had. They had like a can skirt. They had like a book bag with like cans on it. I like the whole thing and how they was using recycled materials and to make like to make them fashionable. I like that. So. The environmental fashion show was a great success this year. This was no ordinary fashion show. Here, Nightperg in coalition with Alianza Latina, Swag, Haitian Students Association. African Students Association, Caribbean Students Association, and Glamazon created high fashion, chic couture clothes made from recycled goods. Much time, creativity, and dedication was given to make this program the best fashion show of the semester. Any suggestions or questions? Um, just keep up the good work, my friend. And shout out to the full interns, especially Larice. The so four 2011 interns, I think they work hard. They put very dedication into the work that they did. Especially Lovey! Because you guys are home there. <laughs> Night Perk, man. Shout out to Night Perk. Night Perk is cool. Everybody in Night Perk, Night Perk is cool to support good causes. They do a lot of fundraisers, and I mean, they support a lot of things for the school. I respect it. Join it. You know what I mean? Yes. Thank you. <laughs>